Oh, we've got a great game for you today. I'm Martin Tyler, Alan Smith is with me. We're both really looking forward to describing it for you. Valladolid play today, and they play Real Madrid. How far can young Alex Hunter go in his career? He seems to have shown plenty of early promise. He got a hat-trick in his last match. What a performance. So this is how the hosts line up today. The system that we think they're going to go with is 4-5-1. That one striker will need a bit of support. Yeah, you do not want him to be left isolated. Otherwise, this formation will not work. This is the Real Madrid lineup. Well, we've gone with a 4-3-3 formation here for them. Is that the way you see it, Alan? Yeah, I mean, it can be adjusted. It could almost be a 4-5-1 if they decide to come over all defensive, this team. But uh, if they're on the front foot, that three up front can cause the opposition back four some problems. They seem to have moved on a little bit, Real Madrid, from just signing the best players in the world and having that Galactico philosophy. They do get the best players in the world, but there's more of a right wish really to get them to operate as a team rather than a collection of individuals yeah you wonder if they've been influenced a little bit by Barcelona's approach that team ethic more than the Galactico approach great interception Moving forward with some danger. He can put them in front. It's... That was a puff out your cheeks moment and phew. And here's the shot. It comes out of the goalkeeper. Well, they didn't test the keeper the second time like they did the first. But either way, he's done his job and kept the opposition out. Well, he's on fire, isn't he, this keeper? And the opposition must be wondering what they've got to do to beat him. Hunter going at the opposition at pace. He's go. I think he saw the look from the other player and saw where the pass was going and read it. Hunter. Alan McAnally wants to join us now. He's got a goal to tell us about. It's a goal for the home team. Oh, he's been called offside here. Marcelo. It's with Marco Asensio. Great ball. Oh, they thought they were in, but the flag has gone up. It's a very good interception. Here's Isco. Goal news from Bilbao. It's a goal for Athletic Bilbao. 15 minutes played, 1-1. One, one. Well, many thanks, Alan McAnally, keeping us up to date as usual. Bale trying the ball in behind. Pass threaded through. And he scored! He has a little glance up there and he's aiming for that top left. It's a superb finish. Well, it's a goal worth replaying over and over again, isn't it? No great shocks on the cards then, because it's Real Madrid who lead. Just a mistake, really. He's not even asked too much of the opponent. It's just a mishit pass. It's with Marco Asensio. Penalty at 
Villarreal. It's a penalty for Huesca. Bale! Bale! Well, the wonder of the Welshman is fantastic. Brilliant football from a superb team who struck twice in as many minutes. But it wasn't an individual goal, it was a beautiful team effort. Lovely interplay. Oh, he's loving it, the manager. He's seeing his team playing really well, just what he was asking for. Restarting at 2-0. Got the ball back by that interception. That's his game, isn't it? Intercepting. Good vision. And they put him clear with the through pass. It's Alex Hunter now. A little too eager to get in behind the opposition, caught offside. Just failed to look across the line. Played down the wing, keeping the wide attack going. Here's Isco. Cross. It's Isco. Rafael Varad. Not sure how risky this might be. Playing the ball around in their own half. Maybe some threat to their lead. Trying to find an opening. Not panicking. Hunter. Got space to get the cross in. Cross. That's a goal for Real Madrid. That does extend their margin now at an important time. There's a huge golfing class out there, Martin, and that's been shown by the scoreline. Absolutely terrific, this performance so far from Real Madrid. Tony Kroos. That's an easy cutout for the opposition, saw the pass coming. Hunter. Goal news from Betis. It's a second goal for Atletico Madrid. It's been scored by Diego Costa. He beat the keeper at his near post with a crisply hit shot. 36 minutes played. 2 1. Opportunity here. Oh, a goal. They've got one back. Marvellous goal here. Oh, it's come in from a long way out, and from that angle, it's not always easy to finish. Defenders caught out by it in the end. I want to see this again, this goal. Just a reminder, 3-1 it is now, the scorer. We did have to just cut across that report from Alan McAnally earlier. Atletico Madrid have scored in that game. He might just have missed the point there, but that's what's happened. The goal for Atletico Madrid. The score's 2-1. Now he's got the ball. What's he going to do with it? Marcelo. This could lead to a chance. It's good attacking play. It's a good cross. A really close, great technique there. Oh, there's no finer sight than when you get that right. Unlucky.
That's very good shielding of the ball. Modric. Marco Asensio. Marcelo. Tony Kroos. On to Hunter. Shots on him. And he's taken a chance. It's Alex Hunter. For Real Madrid, they're just emphasising their superiority and widening the margin. Yeah, I think so. And you look at their overall play, and they've deserved it. The goal, wherever you look at it, it was very well taken. The opposition in danger of being blown away here by the remarkable start to the game from the team that's taking them to the cleaners. And that whistle means it's time for a break, it's half-time. Alex Hunter, a word on him at half-time, Alan Smith. To be honest, Martin, I have seen him play better, but he got himself a goal, his team are ahead, he'll certainly take that. As you can see from the scoreline as we start the second half, there might not be too much of a contest left in this game. Bale. It's Isco. Looking for an opening with some good control build-up. Real Madrid pressed the opposition into making a mistake near their own goal. Wide player can come forward for Real Madrid. Well, the ball's been deflected out, so it'll be a throw-in. Stopping the pass, getting through with a good piece of anticipation. Goal news from Betis. It's a third goal for Atletico Madrid. It's been scored by Antoine Griezmann. He was in the right place at the right time to steer home a deflected pass. 52 minutes played, 3-2. Thanks, Alan. Saw the pass coming and got there first. Sergio Ramos, they're playing a lot through Tony Kroos. Makes the game look so simple. Way off the front at the moment is Hunter just to get a touch of the ball. It's Isco. Here's Alex. He spotted the pass there, Alex Hunter. He's got his shot off now. He really fancied him to score, but the goalkeeper kept his beliefs and kept him out. Yeah, I mean, he'd be asking where his defenders were, but come at the hour, he stepped up there, didn't he, the keeper? Now we're going to have an alteration. Corner played into the middle. Defended well. It's a challenge for the attacking team here against a mass defence. They'll have plenty of the ball, but they've got to try and break it down. Takes on the shot! Now we have a corner to come via that deflection. In from Kroos. Cleared away, well away from goal. Well, let's pause for a moment to let in Alan McAnally here with some goal news. It's a third goal for Celta de Vigo. 62 minutes played, 3-0. Thank you very much, Alan. That's going to be a throw-in after that tackle. Just looking at the tactics of this match, maybe this substitution will hold the key. And they're looking good when they get the ball out wide, as they've done here. Dangerous-looking attack, but nothing came of it in the end. Shot on! Oh, that's easy for the goalkeeper. Hunter! Opportunity now! Goal, Hunter! Well, he's doubled up here with his second goal. And he 
Bale took it in excellent style, just like the first one. And you can see a slightly different viewpoint on it. Well, I know this manager's been working hard on the training ground in a certain shape, and boy, is he getting results out there. I have to say, it's so one-sided today, but all credit to the team that are racking up the goals. Nothing so far in this game to surprise us, perhaps only the, the margin. That... It could be a chance! There's still danger here after this half-clearance. Comes out with a punch to clear the danger. Just a mistake, really. He's not even asked too much of the opponent. It's just a mishit pass. Sergio Ramos. Real Madrid will make the substitution now. He spotted the pass there, Alex Hunter. Played in the clear. He's got his shot off now. And there it is! That's a great breakaway. The counter-attack, time to perfection, executed to perfection. Yeah, you see this more and more in the modern-day game. It's all about pace, and the scores certainly showed it there. Well, it's great when a plan comes together, and the manager doubly delighted with the way his team are playing. One team really on their game today, the other very off-colour. So we're coming down now towards the last 15 minutes. Taking on the defenders. Short passes, but they're keeping the ball. Anticipated the direction of the pass and was able to intervene. It's going to be a substitution here for the home side. Well, here's an opportunity with the ball over the top. Well. There'll be a signal here at the corner. Substitute coming on. It's a tactical change. In from Kroos. Not really away from the threat here. Good block. He saw the danger and snuffed it out. And shoots! Up for grabs here. Cleared it well. It's 82 minutes played now. Goal news from Betis. It's another goal for Atletico Madrid. It's been scored by Diego Costa. He turned his defender inside out, strode forward to find an unstoppable shot high into the net. Six minutes remain, 4-4, amazing scenes. Thanks, Alan. It's Isco. Alex Hunter. Bale. Hunter, opportunity to cross it now. Hunter! And that's good play by the defender, because had he messed up then, it would have cost a goal, I'm sure. Tony Kroos. And the board shows three added minutes. Kroos. Hunter. Gareth Bale. He's go. On to Hunter. The shot's on, and a goal! He is taking this team apart, Alex Hunter. Clinical in the extreme, an absolute demonstration of goal scoring from the boy. They will be signing the match ball for him afterwards because of a hat-trick. Yeah, he won't forget this day in a hurry, top stuff from him. Last few minutes now, and the die has been cast in this game, really. And it's a win here as the final whistle goes for Real Madrid. Stuff of dreams, really, for Alex Hunter. More considered verdict from Alan Smith. Well, he's enjoying a, a magnificent season, isn't he? Another special performance and the match ball to mark it with. What a day for him.
Alex Hunter. Amazing. Your first hat trick in a Real Madrid shirt. How does it feel? It's what I'm here to do. This club brought me in to score goals, and I'm not going to let them down. Did you really expect to have this kind of success when you came here? Bro, I expect to have this kind of success wherever I play. Look, I just focus on being the best player that I can be, and I think today is pretty good evidence of just how good that might be. No denying that on this occasion, Alex. Thank you for your time. Yeah.